have been reporting a lot lately on this massive dump of sewer water into the bay. But now a lot of people are wondering, hey, is it safe to swim? And are the fish we catch safe to eat? Eight on your side, Jeff Patterson joins us now live in Tampa. And he's been working on trying to get some answers. And it's fair questions, Jeff. They want to know if they can fish or even go swimming. Yeah, not easy to get answers, though, Josh. We've been trying now. We called the Florida Department of Environmental Protection. They told us to call the FWC. They told us to call the Florida Department of Health. And just a short time ago, the Department of Health sent me a really lame one-line email with no real information. Well, we kept digging. Captain Tom Charlton is a charter fishing guide who makes his living on Tampa Bay. How's business? Slow. Business started slowing down for him when news of the wastewater dump into the bay started leaking out. People are canceling because of the uh, raw sewage dilemma in the bay. Charlton has basic questions that his clients want the answer to. I need answers. Is, is it safe to be in the water, to go weight fishing? Is it safe to eat the fish? We finally found some answers at the Hillsborough County Department of Environmental Protection. Overall, the bay is in, is in really good condition. Hillsborough County EPC has been monitoring Tampa Bay for more than 40 years, collecting water samples at 260 locations, and they have basic advice for all of us. We just encourage citizens to use common sense, and if there's heavy rainfall, to avoid contact with the water for a couple days afterward and allow the bay to do its thing and flush out. And of course, the most important advice for Captain Tom. If someone wanted to limit their exposure to the water that the fish swam through, uh, they should wash their hands, they should wash the fish, and they should cook the fish thoroughly. Yeah, good advice there. Uh, the Hillsborough County EPC only monitors long-term conditions to monitor the overall health of the bay. They don't issue swim advisories. That's up to the Department of Health. That's why we wanted them to answer some questions, Josh. They sent us that lame one-sentence email. We have a lot more questions for them, and we're going to keep trying. Yeah, it was nice that you did get some answers today, but why so difficult to just get some simple answers to these questions? Yeah, these are questions the public has the right to know. Is it safe to go in this water? Is it safe to swim? Is it safe to fish? Uh, we're going to keep trying, Josh. Okay, it's all we can do. Jeff Patterson, live for us in Tampa. Thanks for the hard work. Appreciate it.